Hey YouTube, another great day. Today I want to make something I also need for my table saw and that's probably going to be the last thing for my table saw but I need one or maybe even two and that's going to be a push stick. These things I hate. Why? Because when you're pushing these always slip and there's just no control on the end especially when you're trying to push at the other end they're just very awkward I want, I want something like this where I can actually plant firmly down and just push this is what I need so let's get started on this Okay, for this I'm going to use the rough 3 8 plywood. I'm not going to use a really nice wood because, as we all know, eventually you hit the table saw with your push stick and basically you have to make another one. So I'm just going to use this wood. I'm going to cut this. I'm going to just cut it, rough it out on my table saw, just cut this off here. Then I'm gonna take a coping saw. Now I'm just going to take my coping saw and cut this. natural Danish oil there to protect the wood a little bit. Well, it actually works like a charm and no effort. You just lean on it and wow, what a difference compared to one of these. See this, you push and it's, you go like this and it usually it slips and uh, you, tr you know, it's just very awkward. This, you're actually sitting on it and Wow, what a difference. It's a very simple project, but it's a must have. Um, I compared it with my push stick, you know, those, those long plastic push sticks. It doesn't even come close to one of these. And this, I just took some old, unfinished 3 8 plywood. I'm gonna make a few more of these and uh, See, I got a hole right here so I can just hang them on my wall. What a, and I might even uh, paint a little bit of red over here so I don't throw them out by mistake thinking it's uh, scrap wood. Well, there you have it, guys. Go for it. Make one. On that note, we'll see you guys on my next video.